Welcome back to Anime Beyond. Today we're going to react to episode 65 of Dragon Quest. Now last episode we saw Dai and the crew, they got their new and upgraded equipment, yeah. their weapons, and uh, there's a little uh, hexagon going on that we kind of, you know, got in a mix of, you know, Amy likes Yonko, so does Man, and you know, you have all this stuff, and then uh, Man was going up to Pope and telling her, like, all... You know, obviously, I understand what Pope was feeling. Like, you don't just... I mean, yeah, it was just bad timing, bad timing. But anyway, they're getting ready to go to battle. And this time, there is no turning back. Mm -hmm. But good thing is, because Lombard gave them the weapons, they should be more than ready, in my opinion, I think. Yeah. So not only that, but Lombard's joining, so... <laughs> <laughs> and we got their uh, master, Ma'am and Chewie's master. Well, actually, that's he's part of the Beast Squad now. So oh, yeah. He's a subordinate, that, That's course. true. Yeah, I don't know hey, who you're talking about. Hey, my bad. Yeah. That's on me. That's on me. Right. I'm looking forward to seeing Mr. Vern. Is he going to, you know, betray Vern? Kyunko, what's his plan? And uh, what are the heroes going to do? Are they going to actually save them in this episode or what? I don't know. So, uh, a lot to look forward to, but without further ado, we're going to get right into it, so let's get it. The Dark Yunko. Oh, no. Okay. I was wrong. Or was I? Okay. You know what I'm saying? You Were, were you the one saying he's going to take a little sip? A little, a little swig? Oh! Yeah, keep it classy. You oh, know, okay, you got to pinky but... out. Animation change and everything? Bro, this is like the Cell games, and they're getting killed. I kind of got a little, a little dizzy there. Okay, they. We know they're not sneaky. Why is he Dude, so he's cool? He's just chilling. Why? He's. He. I like. I like. I like. I like Lombard. Does he know? Do they? Yeah, he knows that they're here. Maybe not, because they're all the way up there. もっともっと高く強く輝いている。勝負だ。団長と鎧のモンスターが三十六体。Dang. <laughs> Mm. Okay. Uh, I don't know about that. Let Lombard kill. Oh, here it is. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, he ain't playing around. What? You can't sell it twice. Oh, he got a re he got a refund last time. Oh, that's true. I'm telling you, I think he figured something out with Avon. Remember when we were talking about that? Yeah. So he actually drunk it. Oh, so okay, yeah. Don't forget. No, he drunk it because there was nothing in it. Oh, snap! Oh, my goodness. His hair turned. It it's turned black. black. Whoa, that's it's kind of cooler. He's, maybe he's thinking about overcoming the darkness with light. Mm. 
Hey, he did it before. He and it. he got over it. But it's still there. Yeah. Um. Mm -hmm. Exactly what I said. <laughs> Maybe this is where you underestimate Mr. Rune. But when he sees die, what will happen to that light? Mm. Okay. Oh. This is Itachi. Itachi said kill your kill someone you care about. Oh. Sasuke. <laughs> I was like, you think he's the good yeah. person. <laughs> no. It could be. I'm still hoping that Mr. Ren is on his side. <laughs> What is Slomberg thinking? He's a darkling. Okay, yeah, he's still fighting. I want to see that internal conflict. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh. I'm feeling like Pop's gonna come and change his mind, and then his his crystal's gonna light up, cause that's Pop. Oh, that is true. Oh, he's doing it on his own? There's that light. Overcome. Shit. Oh, what did I say? Oh, but he got his injuries back. Wow, I was wrong. He took all on his own. No, he's not dead. Oh, wow. Hey, I trust Merle. They can revive him. Mm. <laughs> Let's go. Wait, is this like when Goku shot? The beam up in the air to start his heart? I feel like it's gonna happen. I feel like that is what's gonna... Whoa! <laughs> Did he do that move to where he acted... He gets rid of all magic? You don't even need that sword. Because uh -uh. he now all oh, light. Mm -hmm. that's, that's the power of the Lotus, man. I wonder how Amy's feeling right now. I don't know. 
She didn't understand him. And she heard Lomberg say it. Mm. He risked it all just for that. He laid his cars down, man. Yes, sir. Doesn't work anymore. Hey, he say he's plucking him. <laughs> Break his mask again. See what he does. Oh. Dang. <laughs> Dude, he doesn't need a weapon for real. Wait until he gets his new spear. Dude, he's gonna be OP. Yeah, boy. Hey, I love it when a squad comes together. When the squad shows up. Whoa, look at his aura. Dude, it's like a dragon. Yeah. Dude, that was a good entrance. I like that. Oh yeah. Oh, you wanna have fun? Uh... Why didn't they bring the weapons with them? Oh, because Amy took the other one. Wait. They probably zoomed in. Yeah. Oh no, or not. Mm. Dragonite. True Dragonite. Oh, she's <laughs> She, she's, she's playing both sides. Look at her. Mm -hmm. she, there it is. Yep. I want to see Amy. Show Amy. Poe was like, I don't know why we help this girl. <laughs> Woo! Here we go. Yeah, it's, it's time, bro. There's only 36 of those, though. That looks like more than 36. Yeah. <laughs> well, maybe that is 36. Hey, it's gonna happen, bro. It's gonna happen. See, you're trying to force it to happen. Yeah. He Your time's coming. Yeah. He's hoping it doesn't glow. <laughs> it glows. Wait, wait, wait. That's not the color that that we thought. Oh, it is fortitude. Never mind. Never mind. Bobby. Just facts. Yeah, 
Hey, maybe he is sold out to Vern. I changed my mind about Mr. Vern. Oh, no, not this thing again. Ooh. Ooh. Why does he fear him? What is going on? Woohoo! Hey, you know, you know they legend when it does that. Mm -hmm. Nah, it's about to get real. Let's get it. We have to wait till next time to see what Pop does. Ah, uh, no. Babe, it's gonna it's gonna activate though. It's gonna activate. So in my opinion, I feel like Pop's been trying to force out this this insignia to light up. Like he's been trying to will it by action. Yeah. But not focusing his will on it. What do you think his will to fight is? I think it's die, because I, I think about the brotherhood they had he's had with him. Okay, I feel like the way he's gonna activate is it's gonna be something like remember that old man in the very beginning? He said if you have a sh he said go now when you have a sh if you have a shred of courage with mm. it, something like that. Now I know oh, yeah. I know die has courage, but I feel like it has <laughs> something to do with I don't know, I feel like it has something to do with courage. courage. Because honestly, like he's scared most of the time. Yeah. He doesn't like to admit it. But he does it anyway. And he does it because he wants to show that he cares for his friends and he doesn't want. But then again, it's kind of, I want to say it's kind of the same for everybody though. Because I feel like everybody would want to do that. But I just, I feel like it's more amplified with Pope. I always feel like it's been always been more amplified with Pope. I would say, because that's been probably one of his greatest battles. Yeah. What if it's, you know how he plans? Hey, you do this. Hey, you do that. Hey, you mm -hmm. do. Maybe it has something to do with that, and it's like something that brings the party together. Whatever word that is, I feel like it's that. He's, I want to just say an organizer. <laughs> that's that's weak. He's a... Uh, He's a leader, to an maybe, extent. He leads. Maybe that is what it is. Low key. Maybe that's Dude, if, it. He's never... His, Yvonne didn't train any cowards. Belief? Maybe it is belief. He says you were willing to sacrifice. Yeah, maybe. Or sacrifice? Sacrifice. Oh, he did sacrifice himself. Dude, it could. Okay, we're getting we're getting somewhere. So I think it has to do something, like it feels like it has to do something with humility. Mm -hmm. But looking back on it, the reason he came back, like you mentioned, to go fight Crocodile after that old man told him what he told him was because of his friends. Mm -hmm. He was willing to sacrifice himself for him. He said, I'd much rather die than abandon my friends. Yeah. So, I mean, maybe it's care, maybe it's sacrifice, something around that realm. And I think it's just, you know, you can't, you can't will that. Like, that's just like, you're, in a way, you're kind of born with that. Yeah. I don't know if you can actually gain that. Yeah. So, but then that brings the question, like, how does he just activate it or is it something that he has to like like we discussed mm -hmm. has to be in a situation where it's activated so that yeah i a hey, pope i don't know what you're going to do <laughs> <laughs> i don't know but but i mean i know that he's going to activate soon so i'm not yeah. i'm not too worried same um but speaking of insignia we see hyunko you know show his insignia and make it glow of right course the <laughs> but i think it was because you know he had he conquered power of light we see in the beginning of the episode how he actually drunk the cup like we told him like i i predict i'm not gonna lie i predicted but he drinks the cup and uh he actually turns into this black haired dark version of uh hyunko Lead, murderer hold your fire this man isn't black. So Mr. Vern goes on and tells him, hey, like you're not going to conquer this. You know, you thought you could trick me by, mm -hmm. you know, planning this ahead. You got have it way ahead of you, yada, yada, yada. Well, lo and behold, he conquers it. <laughs> that fortitude, man. That fortitude, man. And Mr. Vern is, you know, shocked. Like, how did you do that? And he was like, you know, he knew that the light in him would have this conflict in the first place. I mean, I guess it's kind of like Vern said, 
you put an animal in a, back in a cage, it's going to... If you back, oh, a, back an, an M on the corner? Yeah. yeah. It's kind of like that whole concept. Um, so, you know, his light came out, and now he only has a shred of darkness. And so it's, the roles are reversed, basically. And that's dying out, too. Yeah. So, but you know what? Loki, I, I wonder if he can still low-key use dark energy a little bit since he still has a little bit and then kind of combine it well he said he would never use it again that was his vow well mate and that made him stronger that's true that's true that's true that's true don't don't make him go back i don't want him to go back all right but i do want to see something new made out of something something beautiful made out of like something like dark and something okay yeah Yeah, and and maybe there will always be that darkness in there because like you said like some there's always doubt in people. There's always um, you always have to question yourself. Maybe so that's maybe that's there. Maybe that's what yeah. it is. And if it ever grows, it's because he's leaving away from his path. Mm-hmm. The fortitude is not fortituding anymore. Yeah. I mean that's I, that's <laughs> an, that's in the dictionary. I pulled that straight I, out of there. Yeah. yeah Webster. I, uh, I gotta, it's, I gotta it's an like old edition. One. Yeah. You might not be able to find in the store. Yeah. And then again, when now that he's got this new steel skin ability, once he gets that sword, I'm imagining he's gonna be able to kind of put this ore all around that and that thing's gonna be able to cut even smoother. Dude, yeah. Dude, the way he bodied those minions. Both with. That was crazy. Both with. Go! And then not only that, but I mean, Mr. Vern, he got handled a little bit too. I was a little bit surprised too. I was too. And he got upset again at Hyunko. So, and he didn't have a weapon. That was the biggest thing that got me. But, um. Yeah. Young really like his kid. He's always just, you know, egging him on and yeah. <laughs> making him mad. Well, I told you to go to your room. <laughs> you never do what I say. <laughs> but, you know what I really liked is I liked the fact that despite his situation, you know, Crocodile was starting to doubt him. Mm. Everybody was starting to second guess him. You know, you see the five. I'm going to call them the Fast Five. The Fast Five, five, they held that faith, man. Mm -hmm. They was like, nah, he's got it. He's got it. They see that that light going glitter. Nope, he's got it. Mm -hmm. It's like the light's starting to get a little smaller and smaller. He's like, nope, he's got it. A little smaller, smaller. He's got it. And then just boom. He's like, yep, told you. That's it. And then they just came out and they're like, all right, let's let's get this done. And like everybody came through. That was so dope. that 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 was sick. But also we know that Master, Mr. Vern is not really trying, technically. I mean, yeah. Vern said he could probably lay waste him if he wanted to right now, if he went full power. He said, like, just, you know, chill out a little bit, you mm-hmm. know, let things play out. You know, they're not going to be victorious. But, you know what I'm getting at? <laughs> My boy Lomberg. Oh, I thought you were going to talk about Amy. Oh. Yeah, no, I'm just kidding. Just kidding. I, thought, I was getting excited for that. Who <laughs> <laughs> cares kidding. about Amy? <laughs> Emotional, damn it. <laughs> then we see Lomberg show up, and Mr. Vern gets a little bit nervous. He was like, you. And I'm like, what do you mean, you? Like, you've seen him before? So, obviously, Miss, not Mr. Vern. Or, yeah, Mr. Yeah. Vern knows something about Lomberg that probably no one else does. Obviously, he's been a being that's been alive for probably thousands of years or mm-hmm. whatever. So, what what's what's the history? Like, he maybe something Kilver is also suspicious about when he sees him. I don't know. I mean, okay. we, we'll have to wait till next episode. The, yes, but you remember we saw his face. We saw Mr. Vern's face. That's true. And what was he? He was a darkling. Now, whose little brother could he be? What if he's Lombard's little brother? Or what if Lombard's friend. His brother? Yeah. Because to me, Lombard seems like an old man. But the more I watch Mr. Vern, yes, Darklings live a long time. But he seems to be getting pretty upset pretty often. Mm-hmm. Especially with young. He gets frustrated quick. Yeah. Maybe he's a, a younger Darkling. Maybe. And maybe they're not related at all. Maybe they both, I mean, obviously, he they probably will know each other because he served... He gave the Darkling weapons. So, uh-huh. I mean, not the Darkling, King Burn weapons. But I'm thinking, like, maybe there's a relationship there. Maybe. Okay. That's an amazing idea, actually. I never even thought about that. But now that you said that, uh-huh. do you think uh, Lombrook would be able to, if he is his older brother, little brother, whatever, change Mr. Burn? Oh. Or do you think he's going to have to... Do you think he's too far gone and he's gonna have to? Because that's a good question. Because you know he's now now that I've seen this episode, mm-hmm. it's been made super clear to me that Mr. Vern is sold out for Vern. 
I mean, without a doubt. It doesn't seem like he's gonna, you know, so. Yeah, I think I have to agree with you. I want to disagree with you and say, because, you know, there's a chance for anyone to change an anime, but I'm going to stick with you and I'm going to stand firm and no, he won't be able to. Because, yeah. yeah. Because nothing, nothing, the last chance we had, I think, was what his plan was, but then we saw the company actually gave it to him. Yeah. And so, and he just wanted another, another person to serve under him. So now I'm thinking, now I'm thinking, nah, I don't think there's another, there's any way around it. He's yeah. evil. Yeah. yeah. And I wonder about Kilver now, too, because who is he, you know? Um, Said his cars are never wrong, and he's right. Can he, can he die without mm. Pito? Like, if Pito's with him, mm -hmm. Pito can throw some pixie dust and then pour him back, like he did last time with Baron. Right. But if he doesn't have Pyrrho around, can he die? If someone gets like, yeah, you know, I don't know. Cause you have to separate them. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh shoot, I didn't even think about that. I didn't. Yeah, I'm just. You about, you about to say you didn't think about that, but you did think about it. I. He yeah, got, I you, caught you. I see you slipping right there. I caught me slipping. Dang. <laughs> All right. What I'm looking forward to most is. Honestly, I want to see Mam's master fight. Oh yeah. I want to see the fight with Lomberg and Mr. Vern. I want to know more about that history. But I want to see Hyunko get use his weapons more. Oh like, yeah. Like I want to see how what he how much stronger he is with the weapon. Um, I hate to say this, but I guess I want to I want to see the relationships more sorted out. Pope get Merle. Just okay. Leona get die. Okay, Mam. Get Hyunko. Bye, Amy. <laughs> <laughs> it makes more sense what you said last time. The Avon cast is... Well, Merle's not involved with them. She could be. She technically probably could have been. She's not, but I mean, it, it was only five people, so you gotta, you gotta have the odd man out. But, I mean, then Amy. You know what I'm saying? Whoa. <laughs> you just don't like it. Listen, Amy doesn't understand Hyunko. Amy almost ruined the plan. <laughs> Amy tries to stop Pyunko from saving his friends. Honestly, Amy's kind of like a villain. No, I'm just kidding. I'm not gonna say that. I'm looking forward to and the fuck. And I, I'm not gonna lie. The way this is going, I think if it goes the way I think, I'm gonna tear up. I think that he's gonna be like, so eventually, it's not gonna light up, guys. I don't know. Blah blah blah. I, I maybe I'm not a real student of Avon. They're like, Pop, you're this. You're this. And they're all just gonna be spitting what he is, yeah. and it's gonna be. He's gonna. No. Start yeah. crying. I want to start crying. And then you I, might start crying. I'll get teary. I'm gonna start crying. Yeah, maybe y'all start crying. Yeah. It'll be, it'll be beautiful. It'll be a beautiful time if y'all start crying too. <laughs> Lastly, I'm looking forward to seeing Hadler. You know, we has the three, the three people, three pieces left, and so you know he's got to make an entrance. What I'm thinking is somehow, some way, heroes are gonna get overpowered, but they're going to have. A more similar, I guess, moment. Okay. Like last time, wearing Vern down, but it's gotcha. gonna be even more. And so oh. then, maybe Hadler doesn't have much time left, and so it kind of equals out. And so, I don't know if he's gonna give him the finishing blow or what, but you know, I feel like he's gonna die in a battle somehow. And then maybe, maybe he creates an opening for a die and destroys Vern, something like that. But um, that's how I feel like he's gonna go down. Hadley's gonna come back somehow and, you know, try to try to just defeat Vern. And you know what? I'm actually hoping Die gets to fight with Hadler, but I don't think that's gonna happen. But, you know, hey, we'll see. Yeah. We'll have to see in the coming episode. So, yeah, that's what I'm looking forward to. What are y'all looking forward to? Y'all let us know in the comment section. Thank y'all for watching and supporting our channel. Don't forget to check out our social media accounts. Yeah, Don't forget to I'm like, subscribe. Good. Leave a comment down below. Let us know what you think about this episode, reaction, and review. You can follow us on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, and Rumble. You can also follow our friends on YouTube, Jay Frizzle for gaming, Rich Latin for films, and he's dropping uh, a full-length film on Apple TV that's coming out February 15th. Or text away for sermons, Thought You Should Know podcast that discusses all things mental health, and Gloom Foundry for fitness and fitness merch. That's it. I'm Devin. I'm Noah. And we'll see y'all next time. Peace. Peace.